Chief Janae Harto of the Minneapolis Police Department requested from the OJP Diagnostic Center that we do an assessment of the department's police conduct and oversight process. And she was particularly interested in learning about best practices related to early intervention systems and how to um, really increase police accountability in the department. There were three uh, priority activities related to this engagement. The first was a data analysis examining complaints against Minneapolis uh, officers over six years from 2008 to 2013. The second uh, activity was a gap analysis of the police conduct oversight and accountability process that really involved um, coming on site and interviewing stakeholders and we interviewed a broad cross-section of people here in the community, 45 stakeholders in total. And the third activity um, involved bringing in a, a national expert in early intervention systems and she conducted a review of early intervention systems here in MPD as well as looked at and reviewed best practices in the literature, the research, as well as in departments around the country that have implemented successful early intervention systems. Okay. What we found was um, this department has a number of strengths. Certainly the community, the stakeholders we heard from were very, um, generally felt the direction the department was moving in was positive, that it was moving toward greater accountability. Um, but that left some room for change. And we did identify five gaps that really provided opportunities for change. So we um, identified those gaps, you know, the lack of a really fully functioning prevention oriented early intervention system in MPD, the need to strengthen coaching um, as a proactive intervention, um, also the need to increase transparency in the police conduct and oversight process. Uh, also the need to improve police community uh, relations and relationships. And finally, the need to um, really develop a comprehensive communication strategy. Um, and that didn't exist here. And there were some gaps in that communications with both internal and external audiences. So we developed five uh, recommendations to address each of those gaps. Whereas uh, other departments are sometimes reactive and sometimes have to be mandated what to do, this department is moving ahead very proactively to voluntarily say we're going to make changes as long as those changes are um, based on best practices and what the research says are um, or what the research says works.